Any bike helmet for sale in the U.S. has to meet government safety standards. But details on a helmet's level of protection has been lacking. What we're looking for are helmets that absorb the energy of the impact. Buoyed by its lab testing on football helmets, Virginia Tech researchers, along with the IIHS, studied adult bike helmets to formulate a rating sky as the number of cycling fatalities continues to rise. Some call these ghost bikes. It's a roadside memorial for a cyclist killed by a motor vehicle. 835 people across the U.S. met that fate in 2016. That's the highest number since 1991. The testing tried to replicate varied impact scenarios for bike crashes, including helmets hitting the ground at an angle. To reduce the risk of concussion, you both need to reduce the linear forces acting on the head as well as the rotational motion of the head. Of the 30 helmet models tested, 24 scored good or very good. Only four received the highest safety rating of five stars. You might assume that buying the most expensive helmet would give you a safer helmet, and it isn't what we saw. The $200 Bon Traeger Ballista earned five stars, but so did the $75 specialized Chamonix. What they and other top performing helmets had in common was MIPS, or multi-directional impact protection system. And road-style helmets also performed better than urban-style helmets. New findings to give cyclists a head start on safer riding. Liz McLaughlin, NBC News.